welcome back fellow gamers, Dire Cross here, coming back with more stories, Path of Destinies. Um, so we're going to get into this here. If I remember right, we were had just been thrown off of our craft of Farfarer, and we are going at the Emperor's Daughter, kind of. So, anyways, um, hope you guys have been enjoying the, uh, this series. I've been enjoying playing this game quite a bit. Looks like we're getting back into it. When he came to, Zenobia was standing over him. Why didn't you take me to the base to be interrogated? She demanded. Do you know what's left of people they interrogate? This is some trick, isn't it? To make me force you again. Well, I won't. I'll go on then. Scurry back to your ravens. I can't stop you, but strangely, she didn't. As Renato set off to find the Farfarer, she followed him, keeping just out of sight of the ravens. Alrighty. So she is going to follow us. Let's see if we can upgrade or craft anything. Doesn't look like it. Alrighty. So, nope, not that way. That's for sure. Alrighty. So yeah, I hope you guys have been enjoying this series. I sure have been enjoying making it. And um He was sort of yanking his own chain, wasn't he? Yeah, basically he was. Um Definitely was yanking his own chain there. Let's get rid of this some ravens here. Yeah. How do you like that? These, these guys are getting to be pretty easy. They're going to start throwing some harder stuff at us soon, I'm sure. Smashing barrels, because we are pretty low well, on health. Wounds closing. Ooh, we hope nothing else closed up that wasn't supposed to. That. Okay. Well, I guess we can't go backwards from here. There was another path. I was going to check it out real fast, but... This game likes to close it off on you, so... Backwards progress doesn't happen all the time. Anyways, if you guys have been liking this series, please uh, let me know. The best way to do that is to like my videos, uh, subscribe if you're not subscribed, and uh, if you have any comments about what I've been doing on the series so far, let me know in the comments section. Uh, tell me what I've been doing wrong, what I've been doing right, whatever. Oh. I'm gonna take that shield. He didn't need it. Yeah, alright. Took a little damage there. Uh, we do have the hero sword on. So we can heal up a little bit. And we'll do that. Because we can. No skateboarding, the sign said. No skateboarding. Well, it'd be pretty dangerous. So, all right. Right. It ain't nothing no more. Alright. As Renato stopped to sniff the wind, Zenobia came up, still mad. I don't you know. Really think you just talked me into betraying my father? Oh yeah, sure. That was exactly my plan. Then why aren't you even talking to me? Because I've never talked you into anything in my life. They're gonna court-martial you for letting me go. He caught a whiff of the Farfarer. Wet rope, tar, and a cask of Scoble ale he'd spilt last year. It was no. that way. Okay. He can smell ale that is a year old? I guess, uh, I mean, he is a fox, so... A sniffer must work pretty well. 
I know I missed multiple, or well, a couple different paths I could have taken. But, like I've said, backwards progress isn't really much of a thing. Battle skills. Let's pull up Flame Sword for the next fight. It is leveled up and everything. Oh man. Mr. Treasure. Can we get back? Whoa, 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 whoa. Get this treasure. Some ore. I feel like, yeah, we can't go backwards. So keep going forward, I guess. And uh, could uh, You can run, but you can't hide. Not gonna happen. Where was a bard when you needed one? Hmm. We can go this way and get that. Treasure. Kind of looked like we could have stepped on that, but must have just been the camera angle. Oop, wrong button. What? Okay. That was weird. Sometimes, when I really hated inanimate objects. Yeah, I do. I like to destroy them with my sword, especially when they give me health and energy. We are full up on that so we can stop destroying them for the moment. Even though it is fun to make the narrator complain. No, oh, I missed. We'll just keep going. I do like the narrator. They have done a really good job. I also saw that there is a new game. Zenobia to the rebel base for real. Maybe she wasn't playing him after all. After the bleak talk about the Emperor's dark secret, he was regretting his suspicion. Anyways, there's a new game that came out on the 15th, I believe it was. Um by the same makers this got kind of the same style sure enough the farfarer had crashed in some rocks there was no sign of lapino zenobia caught up all that kid stuff in swords from school look you know look that's the past we, we, we're, we're adults now we we have duties to other people we have destinies what are you talking about and you are the most arrogant slow-witted Light-fingered, mercenary, immoral, reckless. Run away with me, said Renardo, and he realized he meant it. What? Just like that? She demanded. I will, if you will. So she kissed him. And it was the best kiss he'd ever had. They held hands. They boarded the farfarer. Renardo felt light-hearted, wow. like the winds that were playing the rigging like a balalaika. But Lapino, I need to go back to Lapino, he said, suddenly realizing he could have been captured. A prisoner. Mm. He's not. How do you know? 
He saw something in her eyes he didn't understand. He fell, didn't he? Into the abyss. She looked away. Wouldn't answer. Poor then Lechina. a bolt smashed through the Farfarer's keel. The broken ship plummeted out of the clouds. Not again. Jesus. You fall out of the ship more often than you really should. I, that's what I'm saying. Anyways, I was talking about a uh, new game by the same game makers called, uh, oh, what was it? Ohm something. I don't remember it off the top of my head now. But it came out five days ago. And. Renato oh. picked himself off the deck. They were alive. We have to get to my private ship, she said. Do you trust me? I guess I must, he said. You go on ahead. Clear the path. I can't kill my own soldiers. He wanted to say that he didn't trust her. That he had no idea what he was getting into. Mm. He had no choice, did he? He was following his heart. That's what it means to be a hero. You had to follow your heart. Yeah. It does. In most cases. This seems awfully familiar, this level. But let's check it out. Um, Alright, we have a door over there we can't open. Yep, door over here we can't open. Um, nowhere else to go from this side, right? No, I didn't miss anything over there. Let's see. We can teleport backwards, it looks like. Or not. Nope. Alrighty. Well, I must be missing something. Alright. Is there a, a hook thing? Yeah, I don't have the sword yet, so. Alright, oh, teleporter. I missed it. There we go. Ah, an altar. Cool. Let's see, what can we learn? Uh, dash through enemies. Uh, attack enemies at any distance. Auto activates when reaching a certain chain threshold. Aggressive defense. Counters cause damage. Run faster. Let's do run more faster. More extraordinary. There we go. A little bit of movement speed. A little bit. Can we? Yeah, we can reach that. Where's it go? <laughs> to some treasure. That's where it goes. Me loves is the treasure. Gotta be getting close to being able to build that ice blade. Ouch. Thought I'd get to it in time, but I didn't. Alright, we got some newbies coming in. Come on. Woo! That one hurt. That definitely was a big boom and it hurt. Yeah, this is uh, familiar. Why do I have a feeling? Mother wasn't watching. <laughs> I have a feeling that we're running straight into a trap. We are back at this level. If you guys remember uh, episode one, can we? We'll go this way. But uh, episode one, we went through a very similar level when we had the Sky Ripper and destroyed the universe. And uh, it was basically an identical level to what this. Was really fun was hooking yourself onto a moving ship. 
I'm sure it would be fun. I wouldn't know personally, but I'm sure it would. I don't know why I'm destroying the boxes. I did get an achievement for destroying some of them. Um, I don't remember how many, but it doesn't really matter. Ouch, ouch. Dang, I am sucking it up with that. With the blocks. The blocks, Dyer. Come on. This was not going spectacularly well. Thought no, about. it's not. I'm down to like half HP and I can't open these fucking doors. Ugh. I wish I had the sword already. Because they have the big chests behind them. Alright. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a little better. Yeah, get those blocks in. He was in a swirl of newly remembered knowledge. Yeah. Needed to focus. Break some crates. Get some health, hopefully. No, nothing. Well, on that note, we can heal. Heal ourselves. Screw them. Screw the boxes that won't give me healing items. Whew. Got out of there in the nick of time. What? There we go, there we go. Ow, ow. Thought I was going to get to that one, but I didn't. All right. No boxes? No boxes. Oh, yeah. Yep, yep. I remember this part. They paused to catch their breath. It was strange to be so close to her. What are you thinking? He asked. I'm trying very hard not to think. Me too, he said. Up ahead. He could see the thin silver of Zenobia's personal ship. It looked fast. He would leave all this behind. Sounds good to me. Let's open this first, just in case. Alright. Let's jump on one of these bad boys. Yep. There we go. There we go. We'll kill us some ravens. Yeah, I knew that was going to happen, but I wanted to stop that warlock raven. Ah. Not this time. Yeah? Kind of thinking the same thing. Kind of. Nope. I want those. Yeah, there we go. Unless I got to heal myself. We're almost out of energy. And there it goes. We're out. So. Owie. Dang it. Alright. Let's get back on the offensive. Ouch. Ouch. One more hit and we're done. That's going to hurt. Actually, it already did. Yeah, it did. Very much so. 
We don't have much energy. We can heal ourselves a little bit and hopefully we don't die. Ow. That was awfully stupid. Swing right into a frickin' fireball. Ugh. A clever engineer named Elon Musk had got his start making floating platforms. Not many people knew that. Okay. Not sure why we needed to know that, but knowledge earned isn't just knowledge gained. <laughs> Those things take forever. Uh oh. What is that? What is that? An enchanter. Can buff and heal enemies. Buffed ravens are super dangerous. Okay. And I'm dead. I knew it. I knew it was going to happen. Well, uh, on that note, um, give me some rips down in the comments. How about that? Give me some some Rip Renardos in the comments. Or Ronaldo, because I called him that for like two episodes. And that wasn't even his name. Alrighty, let's. Well, you can buff him all you like when he's dead. Oh, whoa. Whew. I need help. Try not to get hit, I guess. What, what? What's going on? I couldn't move for a sec. Duh. As they reached her ship, Renardo suddenly felt a sharp pain in his stomach. He was surprised to see a crossbow bolt sticking out of it. I was going to leave the Empire to a secret base, said Lapino. But no, you've had to screw up my plan because you've still got a thing for her. Renardo stared at Zenobia. The kiss, was it real? of indescribable sorrow. She gestured and said an arcane word, and Lapino went flying into the abyss, screaming, I'm telling your father! Then she knelt down to cradle his head. Aww. And her paws felt very soft and warm. Renato stared at the book. He was still alive. Again. And still only flying away from burning Ubar. Had he lived that adventure? Or only dreamt it? Had he really died? It felt so real, not like a dream at all. And he'd lost again. Oh, he hated that. But yeah. he had made different choices. And he'd lost in a different way. It was the book, wasn't it? Oracles showed you your destiny. But this... This was showing him different ways he could die miserably. Thanks a bunch, book, he thought. <laughs> but these were destinies that he did not have to fulfill. But he'd learn another true thing. Lapino was a traitor. Renato had suspected there was something wrong with the mad rabbit. But now he knew there was malice behind his goofiness. All righty. Lapino the traitor, uh, not just a con artist anymore. He's a flat-out traitor. And uh, well, 
Look at the time, how it flies. It's been uh, 25 minutes. So that's going to call this an episode. So um, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment below. Uh, also, I have a Patreon page now, uh, Patreon. If you want to support me um, financially, that is a good place to do so. It will be linked in the description. You can join Discord, uh, the Twisted Crew Discord, or I have a personal one now as well. If you want to join that, um, I don't know if that's linked in the disc or in the description, but um, I'll, I'll make sure it is. I'll try to make sure it is. And uh, Streamlabs, if you want to donate through that, you can do that as well instead of setting up through Patreon to do a monthly uh, thing. Um, if you want to do just a one-time donation, go ahead and do that. All right. Uh, Anyways, just die across and keep on gaming.